Hey guys, Justin here. Today I'll be reacting to SML movie, Junior's Crazy Assumption. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and enjoy. Uh, Joseph, I don't want to go to school today. Me either, dude. <coughs> what, what's that noise? Oh. Hey, what's up, you friggin' twinks? Whoa, Cody, did you get a new bike? <laughs> yeah, I did. My mom got it for me so I don't have to walk to school. Is that a fucking cat? I feel <laughs> like it's distracting from my bike. <laughs> yeah, the cat. I, I think know. we should all focus on how cool my new bike is. But there's a cat! Cool, but... Kitty, 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 kitty! Yo, but... Kitty, kitty! I oh, get... look at the kitty! It has a bell, see? But look at the kitty! Oh, the cat's gone. Oh. My bike, though! Oh, yeah! You got a bike! <laughs> yeah, yeah, I did. Joseph, you see his bike? Yeah, dude. I took... What? <laughs> Joseph just stole your bike! I don't... I don't know what I was expecting. Well, I don't know why he thinks he can get away with that. We have to see him at school later. Well, I guess I'll just walk to school with you. Come on, let's go. All right, class, today we're going to be learning how octopuses reproduce. When a male octopus finds a female octopus he wants to bang, he rips off his penis and literally pulls it at her, and then he dies. So he literally dies for the pussy, or octopussy. You know, Penelope, if I was an octopus, I would have already ripped off my wiener and threw it at you. Uh, Junior, I really don't know how to take that. Uh, Joseph, where's my bike? Oh, I saw that shit. Oh. Yeah, I had him in quick buck, tight shit, tight shit, yeah, 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 yeah. Octopussy! Hey, teacher, can I go to the bathroom? I ate too many Takis and now my butthole's on fire. Yes, boy, make it quick. <laughs> See you later, chumps. I'm going to the bathroom, which means I'm skipping school. You coming too, Penelope? I clean my room again. No, bully, I have a boyfriend now. <laughs> okay, just know my room is clean. Penelope, what does he mean by that, that his, that his room is clean? I don't know, Junior. Well, that's gotta be some kind of inside joke between you two. Okay, well, Junior, before you and I started going out, I was seeing Bully, and there was one day I was over at his house, and we were watching Seinfeld on the couch, and then we started making out, and that was it. You made out with Bully? Yeah, we Junior's made out, face. and then I left. That was it, Junior. And then the next day, he asked me if I was coming over, and I said no, and he said, but I clean my room for you. Why did he clean his room for you? I don't know. No, you have to know! He didn't just say that! There's gotta be some kind of sick inside joke between you two! What? No, Junior! No, no, I, you know what I think happened? I think y'all were making out on the couch, and he wanted you to do something to his wiener, and you said, no, I won't do it in your living room because your parents might see. And you said, why don't we go to your room? And he goes, no, my room's too dirty. I don't want you to see my room dirty. And you're like, well, how about if you clean your room, then I'll do stuff to your wiener. And then he cleaned his room. Junior, you're being crazy. You know what? I gotta go. My dad's checking me out early because I have a doctor's appointment. Oh, Bye. No, no. Cody, did you hear this? I gotta take a doo-doo. <laughs> hey, dude. Wait, why the long face, buddy? Oh, guys, I feel so much better after that doo-doo. Wait, Junior, what's wrong? You look terrible. Bully and Penelope made out. Well, didn't that happen before you guys even got together? Yeah, but he cleaned his room for her! See, I told you that hoe was a thought. Thank you, Joseph. Well, Junior, sometimes people do just clean their rooms. No! No guy would, would brag about cleaning his room to a girl unless it was he was gonna get something out of it. No one just cleans their room for fun, okay? People only clean their rooms when their parents yell at them or unless a girl promises to bang you. Think about it. Penelope and Bully were making out on his couch and he wanted her to do stuff to his wiener, and she said, no, I don't want to do it in the living room. I want to go to your room to do it, because I don't want your parents to see. And he said, no, my room's way too dirty. We, we can't go to my room. And then she said, how about this? If you clean your room, then I'll come over and I'll do stuff to your wiener. Junior, you're making a lot of assumptions. I mean, how dirty would his room have to be that he would turn down her doing stuff to his wiener? I mean, she, he would have to have pizza boxes stacked all the way to the ceiling, like actual cat shit on his pillow. I'm talking corpses, Junior, for him to turn that down. I mean, yeah, his room would have to have been dirty. I, it just doesn't make any sense. Like, the first thing I do when I invite a friend over for the first time is show him my room. You know, I say, peep the room. Peep the bunk bed. Mm -hmm. Check out the room. Check the fit. You know what I'm trying to say? Like, what a bad host. Like, as soon as they went to his house, she, he said, we ought to stay in the living room. We can't go to my room. Something's up, Cody. Something's up. There's two things making me upset. There's that and one other thing. Well, what's the other thing? I hate water towers. Water towers? It doesn't make any sense. Like, why, why are water towers in the air? Like... The mayor's like, hey, we need to store the town's water. And they said, where should we store it? He goes, up there, 50 feet in the air. That's where I want to store it. Not on the ground. I want to store it 50 feet in the air so it's really hard to get to. Like, look at this. That's a water tower. Wouldn't it be smarter just to put this whole tub of water just on the ground so everyone can get to it? But no, they say, let's put it 50 feet in the fucking air. That doesn't make any sense. Yeah, it's suspicious, dude. Yeah, why? Like, the, the people aren't running around pillaging and destroying towns and poisoning water supplies. We don't have to do this anymore. We can just put the water right on the ground. 
This is like, I don't understand why it has to be so high in the air. Like how'd they even get all that water up there? Why? Water weighs so much. Like that's, that's the size of it, like three or four swimming pools. You know how heavy water is? Like how the hell did they get it all the way up there, Cody? But I, I, I don't know, Junior, I don't understand it either. So there's two things I need you to do for me, Cody. I need you to find out why water towers are in the air. Like is that even, is that even smart to do that? Okay. And then I need you to go get a dick pic from Bully. Like I need to know if his wiener's bigger than me. Cause if, if he's bigger than me, I'm breaking up with Penelope. But if, if I'm bigger than him, then, then, I'll, then I'll stay with him. Oh, okay, well I'm happy to do a little bit of research. Well, go, go get the pic. Oh yeah, I'll just make a Snapchat and pretend that I'm a girl. <laughs> Actually, hell, I could probably use my own. I'm pretty good at this. That's a weird request, dude. I need to know. Okay, Junior. I asked Bully for the wiener pic, but he hasn't sent it yet. But I did figure out the water tower thing. So apparently they put the water up there so that gravity naturally pulls the water down and creates water pressure so it goes through the pipes. Oh, die. Well, that's the answer. Oh, die. No, die today. That's so stupid. What a dumb answer. Well, that's the answer. I'm no, no, you know, it's so stupid. You're telling me they put the water up there for it to come back down. Well, yeah, so they don't have to build a pump. Yes, they do have to build a pump. How do you think the water gets up there? They have to pump the water up there. So they already have to build a pump. Well, they only have to pump it once, and then gravity does the rest. No, how about you just put the water on the ground, and then you use the pump to pump the water out to people? Yeah, that's a waste of time, dude. But then you'd have to have it constantly pumping. This way, you just pump once, and then have gravity pull it back down. Oh, no, I bet it's constantly pumping water up there, because you know how much water humans use? Oh, he oh die. Shut up. I don't want to hear that anymore. I'm sorry, Junior. That's the answer. Water towers are dumb. Oh, wait. Bully sent the dick pic. Let me see. Oh, he said it wouldn't send over Snapchat because the file was too big. He had to email it. Oh, it's in Dropbox. Oh, it's in a compressed zip file. Hold on. The zip file is two terabytes? I can't download all that. My iCloud storage is full. Junior, we're going to need another phone. Oh, oh, okay, hold on. We'll use mine. Okay, let me see if we can put them together. No, Junior, that's still not the whole picture. We're going to need an iPad. Okay, I have an iPad. I have an iPad. Let me see. Oh, my God. Oh, sweet Jesus. Junior, that's just the tip. Junior, we're, we're gonna need a bigger screen. We have to go to the movie theater. We have to project this onto an IMAX screen. Hey, let's go see, let's go see. Okay, Junior, the movie theater employee didn't want to put it Are on the screen. Are you serious? gave him ten dollars, but he said he still might lose his job. So it should be coming on any second now. <clears throat> oh my God, Junior. It's so massive. It's taking up the whole screen. Uh, I mean, he must have used Christopher Nolan's 35mm IMAX camera to take this picture. That's an Oppenheimer cock. Oh, God, Cody, he's huge. It's the biggest thing I've ever seen. There's no way I can compete with that. Junior, it starts over there, and it ends over there. And the worst part is, we don't even see the balls. Who knows how far behind those are? Oh, God, if she did anything with them, it's over. Oh. It's, it's completely over. Oh, Junior. Oh, oh, no, you better hope she didn't. Oh, oh, oh my God, Junior. I, I think the projector just crashed. That's how big it was. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm sorry, Junior. That was a huge dude. Oppenheimer cock. Oh, well, damn. I'm sorry, bro. Oh, I have to leave her. I have to break up with her. No, you don't, Junior. You don't even know if she did anything. It's that big. It's huge. I have to break up with her. That's the right thing to do, dude. Thanks, Joseph. Mm -hmm. Well, I have to go, bro, but I think you know what to do. I'm going to break up with her. I'm going to call her right now, tell her to come over. And I'm gonna tell her I just can't do this anymore. No, oh, come on, Junior, don't do that. I have to. Stop it, hey, Junior. Junior. <gasps> Junior, what's wrong? Oh no, is it the water tower thing again? It just doesn't make sense. Why are they in the air? Junior, I already explained this to you. It doesn't make sense. Nothing you can say makes it make sense. Junior, you need to get over it. I think we should break up. What? Over the water tower thing? No, over bully. What? I saw his penis. What, Junior? What are you talking about? Cody asked him for a dick pic, and we tried looking at it, and it wouldn't load on a phone screen, so we had to go to a movie theater, and we saw it on an IMAX screen, and it's huge. So you need to go be with him, because he has a huge wiener. What? I'm not going to go be with Bully, Junior. He gets to have you. He wins. He gets to have me? Yes, he won the size contest. He's way bigger than me, so go be with him. You'd be happier with him. Junior, we're in, like, fifth grade. Why are we even talking about this kind of stuff? Because, exactly, we're in fifth grade. It's already that big. He has so much more growing to do. I'm not gonna get any bigger. I saw my dad get out of the shower. I've peaked. I'm not getting any bigger. Junior, this is ridiculous. I'm not gonna go be with Bully. There's nothing that happened between us. Oh, oh bull crap. I, if it's that big, you had to do something with it. If, it's, if, if my thing was that big, I'd whip it out every chance I get. Junior, why don't you just ask him then? Because he's gonna lie. No, he won't. Okay, then you stay right here. I'll invite Bully over. And if he lies, you call him a liar straight to his face. Okay, fine. 
fine. All right, I'm gonna get bullied. Uh, hey, what's up, Scrubs? You like my new bike? I just bought it earlier today from your friend Joseph. Really? Oh, okay, so that's right. It was right. him. Cody, I need to speak to you. Okay. So you sent a wiener pick to Cody earlier today, and your wiener's huge. Oh, that thing. <laughs> yeah, that's my favorite practical joke I like to pull on people. I just find a random wiener pick on Google Images, and then I just put that into Photoshop and set the dimensions to be as big as an IMAX screen. <laughs> it's hilarious. It crashes people's phones. So... That wasn't your wiener? No, man. We're in fifth grade. Why would I send a picture of my wiener to somebody? <coughs> well, you and Penelope made out on your couch, like, before she was dating me, right? Yeah. So why'd you clean your room for her? Oh, well, she wanted to go to my room to play Fortnite, but I said no because I pee in my bed a lot, and instead of changing the sheets, I just put newspaper on there, like in the movie Big Daddy. So then the next day, I told her that I cleaned my room, but she didn't want to come over. <coughs> So she's never done anything to your wiener? No, of course not, man. We're in fifth grade. Oh. Well, I'm gonna go. Wait, wait, where the hell is my bike? Hey, get back here, dork! So, Junior, do you feel any better? No. Because why are water towers in the air? Like, why are they way up there? It doesn't make sense to put water 50 feet in the air. They can just be on the ground. Oh, my God. It just doesn't make sense. Someone please explain to me.